Addison's and Cushing's are two conditions that affect the adrenal cortex. The adrenal cortex is the outer layer of the adrenal glands, the two caps that sit on top of the kidneys. To know its functions, you can remember the three S's, sugar, sodium, and sex hormones. The adrenal cortex releases cortisol, aka corticosteroid, which increases sugar. It also releases aldosterone, aka mineral corticoids, which increases sodium, and it releases androgens, which increase sex hormones. In Addison's, there is hypo secretion of adrenal cortex hormones, mainly being cortisol and aldosterone. Remember in Addison's, you need to add steroids. Symptom-wise, think everything is low except the two keys. You'll see low blood pressure and blood sugar, salt cravings, weight loss, low mood and energy, alopecia, cold intolerance, amenorrhea, along with high potassium and bronze skin. In Cushing's, there is hyper secretion of adrenal cortex hormones, mainly being cortisol. Remember in Cushing's, there's a cushion of steroids. And here, everything is high and big except potassium. You'll see high blood pressure, blood sugar, and sodium, weight gain, moon face, excess hair, purple striae, and low potassium, along with other key symptoms like a buffalo hump, which is a fat pad on the back of the neck, thin extremities with truncal obesity, easy bruising and petechiae, slow wound healing, and increased risk of fractures due to brittle bones from increased steroid levels. Let me know if you'd like to see a part two and check out the full study sheet in the nursing school success bundle.